Today, we're talking about sound exchange. So do you guys know what sound exchange is? Sound exchange is uh, the digital version of BMI and ASCAP, performance rights organizations or PROs, uh, that look after your music, look after your publishing. Uh, when your music gets played on the radio, when it gets played in a concert setting, when it gets played in a variety of settings, but sound exchange is the one that tracks it. Spotify, Apple Music, all these different places that are getting plays. And anywhere where you want to get paid for your internet radio presence, it could be streaming, it could be different playlists. There's a lot of different things that go into it, but there's people that pay into this sound exchange pot. And, you know, I kind of didn't even think about it for a while, but I had a record come out just a couple of weeks ago. I was going through my sound exchange and I realized I had forgotten uh, some of the things that go, go into the sound exchange and I thought maybe you guys uh, might be in the same boat. So I thought I would walk you through how to do sound exchange as a rights owner. There's two different ways. I'm gonna do two videos. We're gonna have a rights owner video and our artist video. So as a rights owner, that means you're the person that owns the music. That means you're the person that owns the master and that owns the actual songs. You own the publishing of those songs. So what you wanna do is go to Sound Exchange's website. Sound Exchange. And just Google it and it should pop right up, sound exchange. And then what you wanna do, if you haven't registered yet, you can see here, uh, you can click on artists and copyright owners and you can register. And once you get here, you go to register online and you wanna go through and create your sound exchange account so that you can do it. And then what that's gonna do, you're gonna eventually get your account, get all signed up. You have to verify a whole bunch of things but then what you're gonna do is you're gonna download a spreadsheet. And in that spreadsheet, what you're gonna do is gonna look like, let's see, I'm gonna pull out mine really quick. So here is the thing, it's gonna show you all of my tunes. So this is from the last couple of records. You can see the information that you need. Here you need your artist name, which is probably just your name. You need the album title, UPC, which you can find on the back of a record. This is my new record. This is uh, No Arrival, it's out on Positone Records. Uh, anyway, so you see the UPC is located on the back. Just read that number, get that number uh, down, and and then you can put it into the spreadsheet. So you just need uh, the release dates and the and the label information, and the, the most important thing that you need is going to be the ISRCs. If you don't have those, you can go to um, look them up on Sound Exchange. Actually, just Google Sound Exchange ISRC it comes right up. And then you can just click ISRC search and you can search for your name or you can the release name up here on the top and find those. So if I type in Nick Finzer search, uh, you can see some of these that came up 2013, 2013, uh, and some 2017. These here, these didn't have a release year. I think I must not have filled in the sheet all the way, but I just updated it, so it should update soon. Um, but that's how you get the ISRC numbers. And then from there, uh, in your rights owner account, you just gotta make sure uh, you fill in as much of it as you can, and then you submit it to Sound Exchange, and they will help uh, to administer some of the digital rights for you. So if you haven't done it yet, this is a great thing you need to do. Uh, Sound Exchange, this is the rights owner. So these are the tunes that you own, the tunes that you own, and uh, you wanna get those taken care of as soon as you can. So thanks for being here on Create Connect Repeat. Leave us questions uh, below if you need help getting this done. Uh, if you haven't done it yet, please go and register on Sound Exchange. There's probably money sitting for you if you've never registered before. And if you have registered on Sound Exchange and you have some experience working with them and want to offer that below, I'm sure people would love to hear more about it. So thanks for being here. My name's Nick Finzer. This is Create Connect Repeat. We'll see you back here next week.